<laughs> Welcome to today's episode. Um, I'm gonna be showing how to what I do with the weeds when I clean the customer's yard, <laughs> and um, pretty much the process that I do. I burn them and I eventually turn them into bricks. The process of transforming the weeds into bricks, pretty much. That's not how I started with that intention. I mean, I just, it was a one of the cheapest options and I ended up having a lot of weeds when I was at work. So the easiest option, cause I was always going to a lot, like instead of going to the dump and then to the, to the lot, it was easier to just burn them at the lot. So I started ending up with, with little piles of ash here and there. And then I thought to myself, wow, well, I should rather use this for something else, you know? So I started Googling what I could use ash for. Turns out you can use it for a mixture of lime and cement and sand. And you basically end up with cement. Actually, concrete is made up of kind of ash and lime and gravel. So I'm already ending up with like the raw materials for cement. Sometimes I don't even use cement. So I started to experiment with different ratios here and there, you know, and you know, I was already making bricks uh, back then uh, just because, you know, it could be used for building here at the lot. Another thing you could use the ash for is for fertilizer. I haven't done it myself before, so I'm not sure exactly how it will work, but I mean, I'm pretty sure the process is fairly simple. I mean, plants eat anything, you know, um, as long as you don't intoxicate your plants, I mean, they pretty much eat anything. Pretty much the process of making the weeds into bricks, gather the weeds, you burn them, you mix them with cement, lime, sand, and gravel. Or you don't even have to mix it like that. I mean, you can even just use sand and cement, or even lime and sand, or just experiment with the different ratios and you'll end up with some bricks. And um, also, I, I'm gonna change the name of the page to the landscaping um, yard cleaning company that I have, um, we destroy yard services. So yeah, pretty much the season has already started and I'm getting a lot of clients and requests, you know? So I'm gonna start to get busy and instead of having an additional page and to, to manage and stuff, so instead of having four, I'm just gonna have three. Yeah, I think it's a good idea. <laughs> it's still gonna be the same thing like off grid but i'm gonna just start having some yard related business and stuff you know what i do with, with the company so it's gonna kind of be like a mixture of, of all that since in, in essence it's kind of related because I, I use the the weeds and stuff I, I bring them here and burn them out and stuff so and see what you guys think hope you guys like this video sophie is singing the star spangled banner <laughs> Behold my daughter's playground. <laughs> I brought some lime from the lot, but she decided that it was a good idea to play with my lime outside <laughs> in the in the driveway. <laughs> you having fun, Sophie? Yeah. She's having fun. Who's gonna clean that? Me. <laughs> Daddy, right here. Sophie decided to try on the off mic, right? Mm -hmm. Sophie, do you like good audio? Yeah, and I'm, I'm gonna show you my my campfire. So here, Sophie has her little bonfire set up. For some reason, she thought it was a good idea to add lime to the bonfire. <laughs> and yeah, at least somebody plays with my little art pieces. <laughs> Nobody wanted to buy them online. <laughs> All right, you guys. Well, thank you so much for tuning in. We already cleaned up Sophie's little bonfire lime and mixed thing. All right. Say goodbye, Angie. Hasta la vista. Say bye-bye, Sophie. Now I'm going to go ahead and watch some movies. I got La Llorona, John Wick.